Hello, Dog Bedsit Blogger here, and you've chosen the Red Book. This is uh, my 2009 trip to Thailand, and I'm going to read a bit from January the 10th. And if I'll put a link in here, there'll be some uh, some bits of video of when I was of around about this date. Uh, when I was staying in Ayutthaya or making my way to Ayutthaya for the for the day to meet a friend. So uh, some of the reading might be a bit slow because I've got very small handwriting in this and my handwriting is really bad. Right, this morning we checked out of the hotel so we could get the train to Ayutthaya. We caught the Sky Train and the Metro to the train station. We bought our ticket, 15 baht for a two hour journey, which is pretty dang cheap. The train journey was pretty nice, starting in city and slowly turning into countryside. When we got to Ayutthaya, we phoned Millie. She said to wait for her at a nearby cafe. Outside the train station, was a section of huts and cafes. We sat down and had a drink while we waited in the street. Dogs wandered around. After a, about 10 minutes, we saw Millie walking towards us. We all said our hellos and had a drink and we got in a tuk-tuk. Ayutthaya has its own kind of tuk-tuk. They look like a cross between a tuk-tuk uh, and a Honda Civic and a Thunderbirds vehicle. The tuk-tuk whizzed through Ayutthaya to the King's Elephant Corral, which is where Millie lives. When the tuk-tuk dropped, dropped us off, we were greeted by the sight of about 20 ele elephants and and calves tethered and calves running about free blagging maize from members of the public we then walked past a few shacks a, a few shacks then set back in a clearing was a blue and green house on stilts. Millie proudly said, this is my home. We put our bags down and Millie recommended that we go down to the river because the elephants were having bath time. We walked down, down to, out to the back of the house and down to the river's edge. Floating to the bank Oh, this is awful handwriting. Floating next to the river was a stripy raft. There was a man catching fish from the raft. We stepped onto the raft and watched the river and chatted for a bit. And then silently, an elephant with a small boy on its back. The elephant walked into the river and within a few shouts and stamps of his feet, the elephant rolled and submerged in the water, all without the boy getting off or falling into the river. Once he was submerged for a couple of times, the boy gave a couple of stamps and, and shouts. The elephant turned around and left. Then two bigger ele groups of elephants came, including the mums and calves, which was noisy and a, a bit more chaotic. What a fantastic way to spend an afternoon. Once, an, once all the elephants had bathed, Millie showed me the paintings that the elephants had painted. I looked through them to, to find a print for my parents. Millie and I then went to the local shop to buy some beer. As we as we went in, some kids shouted, Falang! Falang! Which is the Thai for tourist. Millie cooked us a supper, which he had. 
outside. Once it was dark, we moved inside and chatted. There you go. Very small handwriting. And yeah, definitely check out the annotations because um, I've got some of the elephants having a bath. It's all lovely.